and Habib's toughest match yet. Lawrence gunning for Powell again, and that time he challenges the backside, and that's Melifonwu, who's got some pretty competitive guys he wants to match up with. Cunningham under pressure. Chucks went downfield, intercepted. This is just a great play by Melifonwu, and of course yep, he comes foots in. Foots in bounds, secures the That's ball. A pick. What is Malik Cunningham doing here downfield with his eyes? That's Houston on the orbit. Hockman in trouble and sacked. Melifonwu again. Formation. He's going to look to his right just briefly. He's got to throw that ball to Jordan Houston. Check down. Good job by Bill Smith. Hartman off the mesh. Tried to get it to his receiver, Donovan Green, and it was well covered that time by Ify Melifonwu. Josh, Melifonwu is such a good player. He's probably one of the biggest cornerbacks in the ACC, 6'3", 215. One-on-one -on -one coverage to the bottom of your screen with Melifonwu and Ladson. Lawrence across the middle and off the hands of Frank Ladson. From the 24, second and 10. Play fake by Lawrence. Inside route, looking for Powell and broken up. And that was Melifonwu. And, and Tony White's done a really nice job of calling this game. Four for seven on third down for Bryce. Throws it through the 25-yard line, and the ball is bouncing on the turf. Could not connect with Daryl Harding, Jr. Bryce will throw complete. That's Harding, Jr. Five receivers set for Bryce. Picks one out. Hits him at the 38-yard line. Bouncing to the outside is Jalen Mitchell, who flashed last week in his first extended action of the season. Cunningham to the air. Floats it downfield. It's tip. Nearly intercepted. In their tenure at Louisville. On third and nine. Melifonwu, the cornerback. The line to gain is all the way down to the 33 of Syracuse. Owl spins out of trouble again. Has to throw off the back foot, falling away. And that one is knocked away at the last moment, looking for Brown. Melifonwu there to make the play for Syracuse. Well, again, a little bit of pressure created on the edge. Sam Howell scrambles out. And this is a great recovery by Ifatu Melifonwu, who's one of the most underrated corners in the entire ACC. He's long, he's physical, and he does a great job of closing on Deami Brown, breaking up the pass to create a third and long. He had eight PBUs last year. Andre Sisco gets most of the attention in that secondary, but Melifonwu certainly can hold his own with anybody. So he gave up that fast food in the offseason. Hard to do during the quarantine. But he said he dropped about 10 pounds. He said he studied every game of Joe Burrow last year. That ball is picked off at the 33 yard line. Jones comes up with the football. And Syracuse is in great field position. One on one with Deami Brown on a slant is draped all over him. Sam Howell has confidence in his receiver, but Melifonwu with those long arms at 6'2", sticks it in there, knocks the ball up in the air. Syracuse comes over with a big turnover. This has been a Syracuse defense that has been fantastic at creating turnovers the last two seasons. And here's Carter, swing it to him. He gets hit around the 30. Really kind of kept North Carolina in check to this point. Against Austin P. so getting the start today. Took it, bobbling the snap a little bit, now quickly firing out to the sideline, trying to find Addison. He makes the catch right at the marker, and I think the officials are going to give him the first down. They spring free towards the sideline. Big third down for this defense. They bring four. Pickett stepping up. Underneath to Wayne. and For angle on a wide receiver coming across the field. Really good job of maintaining his stride and tackling that leg. Virginia Tech? No, David Wilson probably had a million of them. Here is Hockman rolling left, and the ball is fumbled out on the catch and recovered. Syracuse has got it. 
and the Orange working their way toward the end zone, and that's Mikel Jones again. This pass just a little bit behind C.J. Riley. A nice job forcing the hit by Ify Malafonwu. Ball goes up in the air. Mikel Jones gets his fourth interception of the year. C.J. Riley's still down on the ground, but once again... By Dino Baber's team. And Hockman trying to get Thayer Thomas unlocked. Got a yard there. Melifonwu chased him down. Nine minutes to go. Hockman quick throw. A Mezzi against Melifonwu. 